Hey guys, just Gadamo here with our custom Gundam MSA review. And today I am reviewing my green Zagok. So it's green here, green here, green here, and here. The rest is normal. I dyed this guy with truly green writ dye, which is a normal writ dye, I believe. And yeah, super cool. It's also been cut by a previous owner uh, right in here in order to have better articulation. Zagok is actually, believe it or not, the first MSA action figure that they designed and produced, which is, explains some of its limited articulation. Uh, not my best spot to do all of my articulation covering right now, but you know, what's cool about these figures is if you're handy with a pen knife, you can actually radically improve their articulation. And that's something I really like about it. Look at that, I'm magically holding the phone with no hands. It's in my mouth. Not really. Everybody say hi, Mrs. Gundamu. <laughs> hi, Mrs. Gundamu. <laughs> hi. Sorry if the phone moves and away from the phone. Anyways, it's a cool figure. And now it's been dyed, which means that it's ready for player display because it doesn't scratch off like paint. And, uh... I just love dyeing these figures. It's one of my favorite things to do. Oh yeah, let's move too. Well, I hope you enjoyed the review. Make sure to check out my eBay store, Gundam Zaros, your favorite arms dealer. It's a link down below in the more info area. And check out the Gundam MSIA in Action Facebook group. Very, very cool place. I'll see you guys next time.